Welcome to History on a Budget. I'm Victoria, and right now it's episode two of Antiques and Accessories. We're going to be talking about a pocket watch. This pocket watch I found at my grandmother's farm, and we're not exactly sure who it belonged to. It might have been my great-grandfather's, but it also totally might have been uh, my grandfather's. Either way, it's a cool family item. The watch opens how you'd expect uh, by pressing on the top, and the top opens like that to reveal the clock that is on the inside. This pocket watch is no longer in working condition, unfortunately, um, but all the components are there, so it could, in theory, work one day if I got it serviced. If this pocket watch were working and you wanted to set the time, you would pull the small lever down here so that it was open, and you would then be able to twist the top here to move the hands. And once it was set, you would just push this lever back in, and it would be good to go. This pocket watch also would have needed to be wound daily, which could be done uh, through the top fob here. The back of the pocket watch does also open, which uh, then you have to open again in order to service it. So you can see all the cool, beautiful insides of this watch. Like I said before, all the components are there if I ever wanted to get it running again, but it does need to be thoroughly cleaned, which is a pretty expensive process. So for now, it's just a decorative item. This watch was made by the Hamilton Watch Company in about the year 1900, which means it is 120 years old. My favorite part of it, though, is actually the outer case, although the inside is beautiful. The outer case is what is known as a five-year case. It is made out of real gold, and it's called a five-year case because the design that was engraved on the outside was meant to wear off after a while because of uh, gold being a very soft metal. So five years is about the time that the design would last. You can see that on one side there is a little cabin in the woods which is very cute um, and the design is still visible which is amazing more than a hundred years later. And on the other side there's a pretty classic watch pattern with some little flowers and a little shield in the middle. That is it for today's antiques and accessories. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, if you have a cool pocket watch that's been in your family, let me know down in the comments. Tell me what year it's from. Does it work? If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, subscribe, all of that. I've got more antiques and accessories coming up and I've got more costuming content also coming in the future. So I'll see you there. We have big dreams and small budgets here, but we're making it happen. See you next time. Today's um, antiques and ooh, oh. this pocket watch. Ooh, it's shiny in the ring light. Ah, uh, you can see. Ooh, you can see the reflection of the thing.